Hello everyone, this is Flannel Prophecy Watch. Today we're going to look at some charts because uh, Janet Yellen, uh, her confirmation hearing, uh, she was confirmed and uh, so she's going to take the, she has taken the chair uh, at the Federal Reserve. That's a big deal. Congratulations to her. And also, uh, there was a gold, uh, excuse me, gold futures flash crash. Was it a fat finger, as uh, some people are thinking, or was it a uh, price manipulation, or was was it a publicity stunt to take eyes off Janet Yellen or something else? Maybe the reset that's going to go on and is already going on, and the fact that tapering is beginning. Was all this just a big publicity stunt? Let's see. Okay, everyone, continuing, this is... Uh Market Watch, the Wall Street Journal. This is their uh, www.marketwatch.com link. So here we see the Dow fell 45. It's still well above 16K. Uh, we'll see how much it corrects, but the NAS is down 18, S&P down 4, the global Dow down 2, but gold uh, has recovered from the flash crash as you see here and oil's, you know, bumping around between 92 and 95. Um, it's been sideways, you know, for weeks. But uh, this is a picture here of today's flash crash. This is, again, January 6, Monday, 2014. And around, uh, around 10, 1015, I guess it says here, uh, about 30 points uh, were dropped during this flash crash of gold futures. Uh, this is Gold Electronic Comics, February 2014, as you see. So there we are. Uh, now, also, Janet Yellen um, was confirmed today to be the chair of the Federal Reserve. Also, tapering is beginning of, you know, the stimulus. Uh, so we're going to be, you know, dropping 10... Uh, billion from the tapering, bringing it down to 75 billion instead of 85 billion. Uh, that's going on. You know, and the question is, was this gold futures flash crash one to cover up and take focus off all of these things that are going on quietly, like Ben Bernanke leaving on New Year's Eve? Was that to cover it up? And is this gold flash crash also just a publicity stunt for gold so that gold can rise and the market can go down and things can be a little bit normal and the gold bugs can make some money? Because we know Bitcoin is very exciting because it's all over the place. It's up to 1,000. It's down to 200. You know, it's all over the place, so it's very exciting. So people want to buy it. Things that are steady, nobody cares. This is final. Prophecy. Watch. You stay frosty.